Hi, Katie Anna, Katie Lopez, and Allie Bork here with you with Bookends with Katie and Allie, another great edition. And we know that, you know, summer's coming up. It sure so, Allie, is. It is like keeping those kids really engaged in reading. What's some easy books that you have that they want to read? Vivian in Paris by Maria Casalucci Moore. Vivian Paris is about a young girl who goes through the different sights and sounds of Paris and finds that there are certain things that just make her feel good. And so all of these things kind of help with mindfulness and gratitude, all the things that are around in our world. So especially if you're traveling, it's great. Pink Alicious Cupcake Cookbook by Victoria Can. So this is a great book if your kids just don't want to sit down and read. Sometimes if you read recipes, that's a little a great way. Okay. I mean, how sweet is that? So if they want to help you bake or cook, get a cookbook out and say, well, if you can read me these ingredients, yes. you can help me. Yes. Yes. It's a win-win. You know, you, you have your child reading and you also get fantastic desserts at the end, right? In the summer, you know, sometimes that's our time to take a break from it all and yes. kind of self-reflect. Yes. Yes. So 20 minutes a day to self-reflect. Um, can help with mindfulness and, and um, inspire you to be the best you. And so these two books, of course, Allie Landry's Reshape Your Life, Don't Settle Because You're Worth It, is such a great read. And of course, we all love Allie Landry, our, our hometown girl. Um, this book will help you to refocus your mindset, align your health, beauty, all of your core values. And I really love the fact that she incorporates stories from her own uh, childhood experiences which we can all relate to here in Louisiana and then share your stuff I'll go first by Laura Tremaine and so this is a blogger podcaster who has such great wisdom and and words for all of us especially us women who just need help with communicating with friends and being more open and vulnerable to the you know the questions or the responses that we should have with our friends and the more that we're open the more our relationships will be nurtured and grow. So easy reads for the kids, for yourself, for the summer, whether you want to self-reflect or you just want to keep your kids going on that right, right path so they don't have the slide yes. that during the summertime. Yes. Now, of course, guys, we want to hear from you. We want to know, do you have any questions? You know, is there a book that you would like to see maybe featured on here that you think that people could benefit from? Just email me at katie.lopez at katctv.com. 